Hi, in this tutorial I'm gonna show you the fastest way to make your 3D game assets look so much better with gradient textures. So you can make them look like this. It's a very efficient way to texture your models for mobile devices. So without further ado, let's get started. So first of all we need to create a gradient rectangles in any photo editor. I'll be using Photoshop for this. First gradient is for leaves, I make it more saturated at the bottom and lighter on top. I duplicated it and created gradient for grass, again lighter on top and more darker at the bottom. Then I make one for wood and one for other leaves, then the last one for stones and birch tree. Then I export this image as PNG. Now let's open Blender where we have our models. Create new material called tree. Click the base color and choose image texture and open our PNG file. To fix the UV mapping, let's open the UV editor and click UV project from view. And then I select leaves with L and move their UV map to a green gradient. I stretch up the UV a little bit like this. And then I do the same to a tree trunk. And that's it. We have a nice looking tree. If you have multiple models in your scene, you can copy the UV map and material. Just select other models using Shift, then click on the textured one and then press Ctrl L and select Link Materials. And then do the same to UV maps. And yeah, we've copied them. But this method works only with the identical models. And now let's do the same thing to a bush tree. UV project from view, select the trunk and place its UV to the white gradient. And then select the leaves and place their UV map to yellow gradient. Then select stripes and put their UV in black part of gradient. And then I apply the same technique to the other trees, now using the red gradient. Again, copy the materials with Ctrl L. And I use the same technique for grass. And then I make some changes to materials Roughness and Specular. And create grass material, again lighter on top and more darker at the bottom. And I copy UV material. And do the same to remaining models. If you would like to make changes to the color, you can go back to Photoshop and let's say change red to purple. You just export as PNG and replace the original image. Then in Blender press Alt-R to update the texture. And this method is quite handy to texture your low poly game assets for Unity or any other game engine. You just import the PNG texture and appoint to materials. And it's so much better than any flat color or flat texture.
And this is it. Thank you for watching. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And please subscribe. It really motivates to do new videos. And good luck.